Well, it's Sunday, February 5th. Uh, I wasn't able to get up here yesterday. Uh, had a work emergency had to deal with. Had to go out of town and uh, take care of some network hardware that had took a dump on me, but we got that resolved. And uh, so we're back up here today. And we are continuing on this engine, are uh, looking into the baffles and um, that's about it, the baffles and the baffles. Uh, so we're looking at doing that. Um, so, yep, here we go. All right, just going through some of the instructions here before we get started on this uh, baffling. And one of the things that you have to do is if you've got an original three inch, uh, three inch hole in the baffle, the rear baffle for the oil cooler ducting, uh, you have to modify that. And uh, we had had the original nine row cooler with a three inch ducting and uh, we went to a 13 row with a four inch ducting. So they sent the kit uh, for that oil cooler and part of that is if you've got the original rear baffle, uh, you have to modify that and it's got instructions, tells you exactly what you need to do. Basically, you, you Clico this on. There's one of the holes matches up down here. You Clico this on, and then you have to, uh, so then you have to mark that, you have to mark that inside there, and then uh, cut that, trim that out, and then um, drill new, new rivet holes for the rivets on this, flange for the four inch ducting. When you Coleco this on here, make sure that uh, when you go to transfer drill these holes, you can uh, make sure that this, the corner of this this flange here matches up with the bend that they put in this uh, baffle. Thank <laughs> you. 
Well, not too bad of a day out here. It's uh, cloudy, a little cool, but not bad overall. So we'll take it. All right, wrapping it up for today. And uh, we started work on that aft cooling baffle on the engine on the right side. Uh, ended up with a mystery part here. We've got a KPPW 0326-24 and they list it as a cooling baffle outside barrel plate aft. It is nowhere to be found on that diagram and I'm not seeing um, anywhere where it goes on that aft baffle uh, or, or anywhere. It, it looks like this. Yeah. But it number 22 is different. Number 22 on there is a KPPW 0326-31, which we, we, found, have, we have that, and that's installed. installed. So that's today's one of today's mysteries. Um, <laughs> so that's, that's our fun for today. But um, So yeah, I got that um, oil cooler... Um, duct installed on that. We've got the plate somewhat installed, or I should say the baffle, the rear baffle somewhat installed here. Um, and yes, was told we'd need to take this off to get to that screw back there. Yes, we did. Uh, we loosened this, took this coil off and loosened this and we could lift it up just enough to get in there to get that screw. Left this all loose on here in case we need to get back in there. Uh, again, to take that out, but we'll see. The other kind of uh, interesting thing is the grommet hole for the ignition lead that comes um, from the ignition box, that is, that's how close that is to that, that ignition uh, coil right there. I'm kind of curious to see how that's going to work out. I suppose there's, it can bend over and come in here and connect, but I don't know, seems a little tight in there, but we'll see what we get on that. And what else? I don't think there's anything else. Yeah, just uh, those few questionable parts. We seem to have extra parts. What happened was is we got, this engine took two years. Um, we, we were waiting on this. And right before we got the engine, or I guess when they got the engine, 
Um, they sent us a, rev was it a revised kit? Mm -hmm. It was a revised kit. Um, yeah, we got, um, well, not the bath. No, the oil, sorry. The, oh, the, the oil cooler. We, well, we, we exchanged the oil cooler. We went, with a, went up to a 13-row oil cooler, which is now standard. Um, but they did send us the, the coil mount uh, change. That's a new design that they did. But uh, I wonder if that's, this is a holdover from the old design, and we've got the original baffle plate for that. So who knows? Uh, anything else? Well, uh, yeah, like I said um, earlier, I um, had an emergency work trip I had to do yesterday, so unfortunately we couldn't get up here and get this work done yesterday. So today was the day for that, and um, I'm taking Friday off, right? Yep. I'm not. You're not. I might be back up on Friday. Oh, no. No, this Friday we're both off because it's my birthday. Oh, yeah. Yeah, birthday weekend coming up. So, um, anyways, we're, well, we'll figure out where, I mean, obviously we're going to be back. Just don't know quite when right now. So, anyways, hey, thanks for watching, everybody. Have a good evening, and that's it for now.